हेलो एवरीवन सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द सेकेंडरी स्किन लियंस सो इन द सेकेंडरी स्किन लियंस दिस वर एट टाइप्स सो सेकेंडरी स्किन लीजंस सो बेसिकली वट वी वट डू यू मीन बाय द सेकेंडरी स्किन लियंस सो सेकेंडरी स्किन लीजंस मीन्स एदर दे वर लीजंस विच मॉडिफाइड एदर बाय ट्रीटमेंट और एदर बाय स्क्रैचिंग और इवोल्यूशन ऑफ अ डिजीज सो दे आर मोडिफाइड lesions modified either by treatment or by scratching or evolution of disease or evolution of disease so these were known as the secondary skin lesions so here the first type of the secondary skin lesion is is the scale is a scale so scaling is a secondary skin lesions so what will happen in the scale so in this uh, visible exfoliation of the stratum corneum will be will be seen so there is visible exfoliation of stratum corneum will be seen and the example uh, for scaling secondary skin lesions were like psoriasis or we can say seborrheic dermatitis so psoriasis seborrheic dermatitis or in other word we can say the dandruff also the example of scaling that is also a secondary skin lesions and the second type of secondary skin lesion is a crust form so crust is a secondary skin lesions so what will happen in the crust so in the crust there a we see a dried exudate we see a dry exudate on the skin dried exudate on the skin will be seen either it is in the form of a serum or it can be in the form of a pus or in the blood and we see a golden brown crust in the crust form so we see a golden brown crust will be seen in the crust that is a secondary skin lesions and the example for it is a non bullous impetigo please remember it is non bullous impetigo so it is the example for the crust form that is also a secondary skin lesion here the example is non bullous impetigo here psoriasis seborrheic in this we see a scaling now the third type of secondary skin lesion is erosion so the third type is erosion so in this we find a focal or a total loss of the epidermis layer so in this we find a focal or a total loss of epidermis so as we see in this image that there the upper layer that is the epidermis layer is lost here so up, upper layer is lost so it is a erosion type in which we find a focal or a total loss of the epidermis while in the crust we find a golden yellow brown crust uh and it is seen in the non bullous impetigo while this is a scale look like a scale or a we can say uh it is example for scale is a dandruff also so these were the three types of the secondary skin lesions and we have more other types of the secondary skin lesions so those were the fourth type is ulcer fourth type is ulcer so what will we will see in the ulcer so in the ulcer we there is finding of loss of epidermis we see a loss of epidermis partial or total loss of dermis partial or total loss of dermis in the erosion we see that the loss of epidermis is there while in the ulcer we find the epidermis is totally lost but here the dermis also get lost either the dermis is partially or it can be total loss of the dermis layer also so this is the difference between ulcer and the erosions only in the erosions only the epidermis layer is eroded while in the ulcer epidermis and dermis layer both are involving and both are going to loss and the fifth type so the fifth type of the 
secondary skin lesion is fissure fissure is also a secondary type of skin lesion so in this we find a what do we mean by the fissure so fissure is a linear fissure is a linear deep cleft linear deep cleft in epidermis or dermis in this we did not find the loss we find the cleft between the epidermis or in the dermis layer of the skin so this is the fissure so in this we find a cleft between uh, in either in the epidermis layer or in the dermis layer now the sixth type of the secondary skin layer is excoriation so excoriation will occur when we are going to rub a particular area then the linear or punctuate in this we see a linear or punctuate abrasions we see the abrasions induced by scratching which were induced by scratching when we rub or scratch then we find the excoriation so and in other words excoriation were also known as scratch mark well also known as scratch marks so scratch marks were seen in the excoriation so excoriation is a scratch marks as we see in this image scratch marks were there so it is a excoriation while in this we find a deep cleft is there between either in the epidermis or in the dermis layer so it is a fissure while in this image we see a ulcer is there so in this there is loss of the total loss of the epidermis is there and either the partial or total loss of dermis is also there in the ulcer so now the seventh type of the secondary skin lesion so the second seventh type of secondary skin lesion is lichenification that is lichenification so what we'll see in the lichenification when there is chronic inflammation is going at a particular area then that particular area is going to become hyperpigmented and that skin becomes thick and the x aggregated skin marking were seen in the lichenification so i am going to write all these findings of the lichenification so in the lichenification chronic itching is there when we rub a particular area for a long time then it uh, convert into the lichenification and the skin become the thick that particular skin become the thick and there is x aggregated skin marking is there x aggregated skin marking is there so in the image as we see here that the particular area become the thick and we see a lichenification is there because the skin is got uh, thick and x, x aggregated skin markings were seen so it is a lichenification please remember it now in this image what we the eighth type of the secondary skin lesion is a uh, atrophy so atrophy so is the secondary skin lesions so in this what will happen in this there is uh, the structural component is loss so here the loss or we can say a decrease in structural component of skin so in the atrophy there is decrease or loss in the structural component of the skin so as we see here though the structural component is lost and it is a uh, atrophy so all these were the secondary skin lesions the this in the secondary skin lesions we cover the scale so secondary skin lesions we cover eight types so in eight types we first we have the scale then we study the crust erosions we also study the ulcer fissure excoriation lichenification and the atrophy lichenification and atrophy all these we studied in the secondary skin lesions so i hope you get benefit of this video thank you bye bye guys